The African wildcat looks surprisingly domestic. Mainly active at night, it spends much of its day relaxing in these branches. Its stripy legs are perfectly camouflaged against the tree's gnarled bark. At around 11 pounds, it could easily be confused with a domestic tabby cat. Distinguished only by its longer legs and the rufous colouring behind its ears. It was cats like these that were first domesticated 6,000 years ago in ancient Egypt to control rat populations. And like those ancient ancestors, this wildcat's favourite prey are mice and rats. <laughs> 